Hey y'all, so in today's video, I'm gonna be showing you guys how I do my Senegalese, Senegalese, however y'all be saying it, um, twist um, with the curly pieces. So I guess they would be like boho Senegalese and I'm doing it with braiding hair and this is the first time I'm actually doing it. So let's just get straight into it. So first I'm using um, pre-stretched um, expression, but it's in the color too. It's okay, it, it'll blend right in. Um, but yeah, I just have this and then, hold on. I ended up getting track bundles in Deep Wave and this is the brand. Um, so yeah, that's all I'm using. And then I'm using Shine and Jam, um, my rat tail in with my brush and I'm not doing the traditional parts. I am doing like curve oval parts, um, basically free parts, cause I didn't feel like um, doing the parts. So basically I already made the curve piece, if y'all can't tell what I mean. The curve piece right here, and you know, put a little edge control right there. Brush it in, brush it in. And now I'm going to start off by braiding it. And then I'm going to turn this braid into a twist. So I split it into two, take the three, split it into two and start off the twist. And I'm just going to keep adding in hair and I'll let y'all know when I get to adding in the curly pieces. So now I am putting in the curly piece and what I do is flip it back over my head, drag it down, put it under my thumb and that's how it is inserted in there. And that piece is just back out the way. Now that I'm all the way at the end, what I do is start braiding it and then I add in the curly piece at the end. And y'all will see what I'm talking about in just a few seconds. <laughs> So I'm all finished. Um, I just want to give y'all a little um, tip, inside hack, whatever you want to call it. Um, I use, don't mind my bottle, it's been through it, but I use the got to be um, 
ultra glued styling gel on my edges and my edges they tend to stay like they'll last all day if I put this on my edges so let me just show y'all tell me y'all love this ASMR of me brushing my edges delightful right yeah I know And then normally what I get to make it like dry quick is I get my scarf and I just hold my hand over it. And then I do the same thing. So, just because I'm trying to get it to dry quick. But normally I just lay it like that. For like five minutes and it'll be completely dry and holding all day but it should be good for now okay and so let me let me let me give you a different angle so i just wanted to show y'all how long they were let's see if i can stand on my tippy toes and y'all still can't see but they literally come to my calf muscles, y'all. I've never had any hairstyle this long. And I, I'm like a little geeked over here, you know. But um, this is what I do. I'm not going to do this right now. But just to show y'all, I usually will, since the ends are already curly, I will braid the ends gosh this is hard anyway i'll braid the ends and then dip them in some boiling hot water and that'll make the ends of the twists even curlier so just telling all that but i'm not going to do that right now because i like how the curls are i'll probably do that when the hairstyle gets a little older but for right now, here is the finished look. Well, I hope y'all enjoyed this video. Thank you for watching this quick tutorial. It was quick, won't it? Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and like this video. Bye.